antagonists. <clears throat> now, the simple definition of antagonist is an antagonist is the person who opposes the protagonist, and the protagonist is defined as the main character, or the person that the story is about. Therefore, antagonists are not always the villains. They can sometimes be the heroes if the story is about the villain. One example where the antagonist is actually a good guy and the protagonist is a bad guy is Artemis Fowl. And all the fairy people want to do is get back the person that Artemis kidnapped and but they are the antagonist because Artemis Fowl is the main character. Of course antagonists don't always have to be actual people. You could have something like Cancer in The Fault in Our Stars which is clearly the thing that stops our protagonists from having what they want. I personally happen to love antagonists. It was, this channel was called Antagonist 1214 because when I was 12 antagonists were cool. About my five favorite antagonists. But I'm not going to stick to just books because I've consumed a lot of media and met a lot of antagonists. Like I said, I come from a long line of them. Just kidding. Or am I? In no particular order, we have number one, Shishomaru from Inuyasha. Shishomaru is Inuyasha's older brother, and they don't get along. In fact, every time they see each other, they try to kill each other. Number two, Itachi Uchiha from Naruto. Naruto is chocked full of amazing antagonists, but I would have to say out of all of the antagonists in Naruto, Itachi Uchiha is my favorite. Number three is Kefka from Final Fantasy VI, or if you want to go back to Super NES, Final Fantasy III. Kefka was the first villain that ever gave me nightmares. He is evil incarnate, and like literally he's evil for the sake of being evil. He's like, I'm going to blow up the world because I can. And oh my god, his laugh. His laugh gave me nightmares when I was a child. Number four this cat because he constantly is challenging my authority <clears throat> by jumping on my computer for number five i'm going to go with loki from thor and the avengers because he's simultaneously very evil and able to elicit sympathy and i find that very entertaining sea bear i told you you would find a way in even if that way is Grant opening the door for you. He really wanted to see you or lay on my computer. Lay on my computer is more accurate. 